Open the image of interest using image J. In this image, there are nine objects and we will measure the area, perimeter, and length of these objects. The first step is to set the scale for measurement. Select the line tool from above and draw a line parallel to the scale up to one centimeter in length. Now click on analyze and set scale. In the set scale window, input the known distance as one and the unit of length as centimeter. To analyze multiple images, check on global. Once completed, click OK. Deselect the line created for setting up the scale unit. To automate the measurement of the area, perimeter, and length, a macro has been generated. To open the macro, drag and drop the macro into the ImageJ software. This macro is available in the description below. Simply copy the code and head back to ImageJ and click on Plugins, New, and Macro. In this macro.ijm window, paste the code. To save this macro for future use, click on File, Save As, input a name for the macro with the extension .ijm and save it. The macro that has been generated has the following inputs. First, the macro converts the image into an 8-bit image. In the next step, the auto threshold is applied to the image. Following this step, a set of parameters are defined to execute the output area and the perimeter. Users can modify the particle size according to the object sizes in the image. Once all the analysis is completed, the next step will prompt you to save the results in a .csv format. Click on Run to execute the analysis of the object measurement. Save the output result in the directory of your choice. This result is now ready for further analysis. In the results window, the output values corresponds to the area, perimeter, width, height, and the angle of the objects in the image. For the object 1 in the image, the length would correspond to the width of the object measured. Similarly, for object 2, the width measured as 5.29 cm would be the length. For the object 3 in the image, if the height is considered from top to the bottom instead of left and right sideways, then the height of the object measured would be considered as its length. The object 10 in the image corresponds to a ruler. Therefore, this analysis can be ignored. If required, the image can be cropped to leave the ruler out of the image before analysis. Please visit the YouTube tutorial on how to crop image using image J. The link is in the description below. Now, let us open the result that was saved earlier. Users can use an Excel program to open the file. In this file, users can find all the data required for further analysis. Thanks for watching.